Hey guys, so we're literally driving into Awesome Towns right now. How excited are you, Shadi? I'm so excited, like everyone's cars excited. Are you excited, Mum? Yup. Yep, you heard that guys, that's excitement right there. <laughs> Guys, we've just got to Alton Towers and we're literally staying at the Woodland Lodges in the Enchanted Village. Raising right Arabella, Shadi and the kid, and this lovely lady. Say hi! Hi! hi. An ice cream shop. It's so good there. They've got loads of cornettos and they've got like... So we've just checked... No. <laughs> so we've just checked here, we've got our keys and everything. They give you like this cool little thingy. <laughs> um, yeah, so some secret information. Our keys there and we're just... <laughs> my head's my face, sorry. <laughs> Seesaw. That's There's four seats in that seesaw. Yeah, so we're just <laughs> we get so distracted so easy. Um, yeah, so we're just walking to our room, which is just down there. So we should be there any minute now or any second actually. Any hour. I just, I just really wanna. We've got a climbing frame and everything. I just want to go on that seesaw now though. So I'm currently outside our room on this bench here, um, as you can see there's one over there, that's what I'm sitting on. And um, I'm reading a book and I just wanted to talk to you about it really quickly. So it's called Star Racers and it's by Martin Philando and it's actually a really good book. I'm not into sci-fi and stuff but this book just changed my mind about all of that. So I'm not going to ruin it and tell you what it's all about but there's a quick look at I'm sitting down and I'm drinking. If you look, look at this hut, it's so nice. Yeah, look at the front door. The front door is like really nice. It's like just a wooden green standard like door. And I'll, let me show you from outside. From outside, it looks even cooler. So from outside, it looks like this. So that's our hut. So if you guys are wondering what outfit this is, it's from. Lazy Francis, check them out. I'll put a link in the description. Oh, hi, how are you? Hi, should we go on the walk? Should we run around? Okay, so, we have just almost arrived at the restaurant. I think it's there, is that it? Oh, look at this thing they've got. I can't do this like that, that thing. There's like, like, water there's like loads of barrels, and the water is like going down these. I think that's a water, things. a water pump. <laughs> Hold on, like... wait, let me show you because I can't explain this. It's just it's too much to be explaining. Oh, my All right, goodness. look. My head's in the way. Yeah. So it's that. I'm trying not to get my phone wet because I don't want to. Yeah. So. I think it looks sick. Oh my god, they put a bath in there. <laughs> huh? They oh my god, there's a bathtub. Look, <laughs> just there. 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 The there. <laughs> oh yeah, and I think that's the restaurant above us there. Come on, can we get one of these at home? Yeah. So we're literally inside the water park I don't know if you can hear me, it's really loud because this guy's talking. But look what I found. Because I found the duck in the bath and it's spinning. So I'm about to get my car and like go to the shop. That's one of the parts for sure. So today we're eating at Okay guys, so I've just found a chocolate um really bright. I just found a chocolate fountain and it's got like one side white chocolate and the other dairy um, milk chocolate. It looks so it's light. Let's go away. It looks so cool, so I'm probably gonna get that with marshmallows afterwards. But then again they've got an ice cream machine, so I don't know which one to choose from. Decisions, decisions. Eat first. And she got fish and chips, I got fish and chips as well. And there's like an ice it. cream machine and stuff, so I'm still deciding on what to get. Alright, so me and Shadeen are just about to go to the arcade, just looking for it. I think it's just where I can hear money, and we're about to go and play some games, so we'll see you later. So me and Shadeen are in the arcade right now, and we're playing this game, so basically you've got to put the money um, in here, and you have to try and push the money out, and then you win prizes. 
So we're going to try and do this. We're probably going to fail, but it's worth a try. Okay, so Arabella's got haircuts. It was really fun just in that place over there. Come on, wakey wakey. They've actually been reading these books. Um, it's called Star Races, and apparently um, you've got to win the race to save your planet. Um, Arabella was a bit like, oh mom it's a boys book but then literally as she started reading it she can't actually put it down um so she's gonna be taking it on holiday over the next week as well um but it's actually really really cool it's by a an author called martin philando he's from the states and yeah it's a really really good book so they're all in it to sort of save their planet you know on a big race obviously the adventures and stuff that go on but um i'll leave the kids to let you know about what goes on in the book but it's a very very cool book let's see win the race and save your planet Melee and other ruthless killers threaten earth and thousands of peaceful planets to save billions of lives sashi must find a pilot who can win the race of all races in the grand battle if sashi and her pilot win the grand battle a fleet of protectors of peace will crush the invaders of their planet Massive obstacles and battle jet firepower prevent most pilots from finishing the electrifying race. Shocking everyone, Sashi chooses the kid from Earth, Rev Arden. Few believe in Sashi and Rev. They know what to do, but can they do it? Win the race, save the planet. The Star Races saga starts now. It's actually, it actually sounds really, really good. Um, and you can imagine it must like have some really exciting bits in there. It's got some really cool illustrations as well, if you look. Let's find out what they mean. But yeah, I'll let the kids um, let you know about that. Cool. Okay, well, we're up. We're about to go and have breakfast and um, hit the park. We've got early morning tickets to get into the park. And then, yeah, it's cool. I feel like a little gnome in this village. Here at breakfast, and obviously I've covered mine with ketchup. Shadeen, is it nice? Mm-hmm. Arabella? Yeah? Really, really cool. So we've just left our room and we finished packing, and we're just on our way to the monorail. Which I think is a train, I'm not so sure. Just following these footsteps. There, yeah. That one, the green bird. No, 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 no. Just so we can get to the theme park. So, taking our picture, and we're just going up the stairs to reach the monorail. Found out what it is basically. It's like, it's basically a train, but. So on the monorail we got like a glimpse of the rides and we have never been on one of these big rides before so this is going to be our first time and I'm already scared even though we haven't done anything. Yeah, like You can see them they're like twisting around and stuff and it's like whoa. We just scanned our tickets and now we're in the theme park and in the distance I can see this big castle so I really want to go and see what that is. I think it's like a haunted house. People performing over there, they got hula hoops and they're like Where are we go? We'll go on flip, you're making one Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm not going on the smiler because it's too scary for me. I'm going to stage in, in the okay zone with the roller coaster rides. Where are you going to go? Um, I'm afraid of heights. Why can't we just go see BB's land? Like, yeah. Go on then. I think it's... Don't get me in. 
Come, let's go see Bibi's dance today. <laughs> dimensions as well and stuff and it was just so cool. I want to go on it again but I don't think I can. God, there's so many more rides that we have to go and try. And if you guys are on or want to ask us, we didn't actually feel anything like any like... Yeah, like no, you couldn't no. hear the roller coasters right. or anything. I, I wasn't it, scared. The headphones she just was a bit scared. where we were. Yeah, so basically in the headphones it was like your captain talking, it was like ready for launch off and stuff and then you went bam and then you can hear the, you can't hear the brokers but you can hear like in space and you can fire and stuff and then you go for different portals and you go to like an ice world, a fiery world and then you go back to your space um, thing and there's like loads of little people walking around as well which is really cool and um, what else, my goodness, yeah. Hi, it's me again, the scaredy cat. So we just found these computer things in the smile of it. It's called Smiles Not Always. So what you do is go on, show them. So I've just found this thing in the smile, right? So if I do this, oh, wait. Go again. Yeah. So if I do that, I think it turns into. Yeah. So what it does is basically like you know in Snapchat, like how you get like them emojis on your face. It's kind of like the Smiler edition though, like you get like Smiler hats and stuff like that. It's really, oh my gosh. It just come out of nowhere. Like it just went under me and went over, over me. <laughs> it's really scary. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Joe, you, I'll show you guys. Look at this. See it, look how much there are. Other one is called the I don't know what it's called. It's called like the Oblivion, yeah. And what it does, it just goes really slow, like across, and then it goes straight down. Uh, I was too scared to go on it because I'm like afraid of like going down really fast. But I'm a fast runner, so I think I would be. I think I thought I'd be alright, but I don't think that's gonna work. So <laughs> that. Now we're going on the sky ride and the line isn't that long so yes. So me and Arabella, Arabella say hi. Okay. Okay. So what we're gonna do now is we're going on the haunted ride. We're going on the haunted ride which would be scary. But I think she's not scared obviously. So the next ride we're going on is called Rita. It's like big dog racing and stuff. It's been around since like 2005. So I'm gonna go on it. It's a pink theme, so it looks pretty cute. Um, so as you can see there, it says Rita 2005, and it's about racing. And then they've got this, they've got posters around and stuff saying, the raindrops fell on my head, um, talking about um, like what it's being about. And stuff. So there's like a queen, and she loses her racing title or something like that due to unexplained forces. Because we're in the dark forest, so it's meant to be all creepy. Yes, 
stuff, which I like. I like scary things. Shadeen doesn't like scary things. So. Yeah. I remember that time when I was at my cousin's house and then we were watching, well, he, he wanted me to watch a scary movie and I was crying. Oh. And then I was like, can you please put sea babies on? <laughs> yeah, whenever we see a big run, Shadeen just runs away from it. Yeah. So. Shadeen, you went on your I first hit, big ride. I hit my head like five times in the same Yeah, shape. the guy said keep your head back otherwise you're gonna die. Yeah, but my head was like... <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I, I was laughing too much. How are you so scared? You started crying, there was tears and everything, you know? I know, like, one flipped off my eye. <laughs> one flipped. Whoever Two. caught it must have been lucky. <laughs> Just went on the third team right. how do you feel, Shadeen? I saw my picture, I looked It was so, so scary. Around. It wasn't scary, but it was really cool. So like, basically, you go into this room, yeah, and there's like all these hooded um, ghost things in there. And then there's like a green light, and then you just drop. And then you drop twice, um, and then you, you write the right there's backwards. me! And it's really scary. It's been on Rita and number 13. Which one did you like the best? 13. 13, why is that? Because all these dropped and it held. So basically, you go into this tunnel. Which one is this one? 13. Okay, go on. So you go into the tunnel, yeah. and then the lights go out, and you drop at the same time, so they're just really scary. Mm. And then you drop again. It's really, again. really eerie, isn't you, it? And then you ride back, please. Okay. Oh, and look at the view. Look, see it. We're just leaving now, me and Shadeen. Where's Shadeen? No, where, um, where, Shadeen's gone. He was literally right next to me. Mom! I can't find Shadeen. He was literally right next to me and he's gone. Yeah, but I can't see him. I don't know where he is. I was literally right over there and I was recording and I was like, I don't know where he's gone. Should go check it out. There's like all these little cars up here, all up there as well. Yeah, it's really cool. It's got loads of cars, and they're just like everywhere. And they've got like a sensory garden as well, which I really want to do, but I'm not because I'm gonna look like a really big baby. Looking everywhere for Shadeen, and we can't find him, so we're just I don't know. My mum's going to ask like all the security camera footage and stuff to see some TV stuff so we can see if he's gone anywhere, but I don't know if he's been far or not because. in that carriage. Oh, there he is. Look. That's not even funny. What is he doing in there? Mum, that's not even funny. So, finally we found Jadine. Why did you do that? It's not even funny, you know. Like, everyone was really scared. We even went to like those, what's it called? The lost, <laughs> there's like a lost person place in CBB. Oh, somewhere. that. I was standing there for like five minutes. And then I just saw like three cars go by. I was like, I ain't taking this, I'm going on one. Yeah, anyways, we're leaving now. We're going to the water park. Don't you dare run off so the water So you guys park. can see my packs though. You can see my hair rocking in the water. So me and Shadeen just finished in the water park and we had so much fun. We couldn't film though because I didn't want to get my phone or the camera wet. So I'm just going to have to explain it and you guys can imagine it in your head. Then I might have taken some pictures, so if you go on my blog or follow me on Instagram, so then you might be able to see some. Um, so 
we basically we went on the slide called the Master Blaster and it goes all the way around the whole park, which is really fun. And it goes really fast as well and it's all bumpy and stuff, which is really cool. And Shadeen went outside and he went missing again, which I, I don't know why. Where did you go, Shadeen? Oh, hi. I got the link. So, I went outside. Yeah. Yeah, so Shadeen was chilling in the jacuzzi with... He met, he made some new friends. Look, did you get their links? Yeah. One was called Ewan and one was called Jess. Ewan and Jess. That was Jeff. Jess. Jeff. Jeff. Ewan and Jeff, sorry. Alright guys, so unfortunately we're about to leave Autumn Towers. Shadeen's really upset. He's, he, he almost like crying, you know, I'm not even joking. Cue sad music. Yeah. Anyways, um, I was gonna say my Star Racer book and Jadine's one as well. You should go and buy it. I will leave a little, blah, 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 blah. I'll leave a link in the description so you can go and buy it. Get out now! I'm a scaredy cat still. Yeah, he's he's scared of rides. He's scared of mosquitoes. I can't believe he won on Galactica as well. He only wanted to go on it because he thought it was going to be like the book, which it was like the book, so... High five to that. I thought I was rev. Well, like, I could rev. slightly hear him screaming over my headphones. It was like, three, two, one, blast off, and all I heard, ah! <laughs> Anyways, follow us on social media, Amazing Arabella and Jadine the, the Kid. Kid. I'll leave a link in the description so you can just click it. <laughs> oh, I slapped my leg. <laughs> All right, guys. So me and Shadeen like ran the corner from our house here, yeah? and then before we we went to Hesco's and he brought some chocolate and I brought some popcorn because it's my favourite. And um, before he offered me some of his chocolate and I was like, I don't want any. And now I offered him some of my popcorn. And he was like, I don't want any popcorn because you didn't give me any chocolate. That's the I mean, because you because you didn't eat my chocolate. And then I was like. That, that's weird, it, that's weird isn't it? Like just leave your thoughts down below because I don't know if it, I'm just weird or if he's weird. I think he is weird. Yeah. He is I, do, I weird. don't know. Yeah, so I just ran the corner from our house and I'm about to end the vlog here because it's like... Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. I want to go in there again. <laughs> There's like a sprinkler over here and it's just spraying out loads of water. <laughs> it oh, it went in my eye. Yeah. That's where we live. That's actually good for the summer, just not at this time. When I met you in the summer. Yeah, mm -hmm. anyway, so I'm gonna end the vlog here. Make sure to follow me and my brother, the, the crazy scaredy cat, Shadeen. Shadeen the kid. Shadeen the kid. I will leave a list the, 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 the link the, 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 the in, the in the description, description as I already of said. All my social media and just, just follow yeah, and so stuff. See you later.